What's up, everyone? Today, we're going to be talking about a group of people that we all love. Just kidding. Everyone hates music critics, especially artists. I mean, technically, we're all critics, but with the advent of the internet, it's opened up the floodgates of people who can publicly destroy songs and artists that put out their music. I think we've accepted these people because it's become so mainstream with social media to roast anything you don't like. But back in the day, critics were seen to be the scum of all scum. Back then in like the 70s, you had a writer for a popular magazine rake you over the coals, at least in a creative way sometimes. But now reviews are scattered all over the place in every corner of the earth, except Antarctica. We all know that's probably where they keep the aliens. I mean, a lot of artists thought that these people had the gall to judge their music when they couldn't put out music themselves and didn't have the perspective of being an artist. My favorite, Billy Joel, used to be a music critic himself for a very short time, and he reflected on it and said to himself, you know, what am I doing judging these artists' music? Billy has had his fair share of music critics dumping a hot steaming load of shit. We all know music is incredibly subjective for the most part, so there's always someone out there that's gonna hate music in every genre and every artist, but these critics have taken let's say a less constructive way of criticizing music and just completely roasting music artists. I mean, I have some songs and artists that I kind of roast too, but not publicly. I mean, if I'm gonna work with someone like Jennifer Lopez one day, oh, damn. What better place to find mean comments about music and artists? Twitter, the social media cesspool that just keeps on giving. So let's get started. These first ones are about J-Lo. J-Lo is trash and always has been. Her music career wouldn't be what it is, whatever it is, without black people. She is a diva for no reason. Somebody humble that hack down. Yeah, we're just jumping right into the fire. I mean, they're called mean tweets for a reason. This one was in response to a J-Lo beauty tweet. Can you tell J-Lo to focus on her lip syncing music career and terrible acting? She must not be everywhere. Let's just hope the J-Lo brand doesn't expand into bidets. This one is in reference to the Super Bowl halftime show. Shakira and J-Lo suck, LOL. The weekend's performance will be way, I'm assuming that's supposed to say better, because he actually has talent and doesn't have to rely on booty shaking to put on a good show. But I mean, see how subjective it is? Because I've heard people say that J-Lo and Shakira's halftime show, I think it was what, 2019? That that was the best one ever. And honestly, I don't mind watching J-Lo and Shakira shake their butts. The more human existence continues, the more J-Lo sucks. I guess it would be interesting to see J-Lo in the next Human Centipede movie. Dear Jennifer Lopez, your new music sucks. Please stop. Thanks. Get her ass so you think you can dance. Wait, so you want her to be off the one show that she's actually qualified to be on? If album titles were honest, my music sucks and I can't sing, but I got a fat ass. Jennifer Lopez. Hmm. I'm seeing a pattern here. Jennifer Lopez's music sucks. She's been trashed and splitting with P. Diddy, a.k.a. Puff Daddy and getting that butt reduction. Is the Today Show now the J-Lo show? Why not Shakira? Wait, what? J-Lo got a butt reduction? I'm gonna have to investigate this further. Yes, J-Lo, this is perfectly normal. I'm a professional. Next up is Lady Gaga, or how I like to call her, Lady Gaga. Lady Gaga's music sucks. Straightforward and to the point. To be honest, I love Katy Perry and Lady Gaga. Some of their music really sucks, but I really admire them for who they are. I guess that's kind of a compliment. Here's one that includes a few at once. Garth Brooks, your music sucks. Jen Lopez, you are ugly and have no class. Lady Gaga, back to hell, demon. What a pile of garbage these people on this list are. To which Fitty Nap replied, disagree on Garth, agree on the other two bimbos. At least they just shut up and sang. I guess they won't be attending any Me Too rallies anytime soon. And I don't care what you say, J-Lo is not ugly. Rita Ora, Miley Cyrus, Rihanna, Lady Gaga, they are doing a good job. Their music sucks though. Seems like someone there is a bit confused. Lady Gaga is irrelevant at this point. Her music sucks, her opinions are ridiculous, and she is definitely not good looking. Now we know why she wears all those masks, says the person with no profile picture. I have never understood her. Her music sucks, her videos are horrible. Who leans back like that and moves all weird when they talk? Is she on medication? Are the side effects a leakage? Please tell me you are not a doctor. Remember, I am not a doctor. Up next is BTS. K-pop sucks. BTS has no talent and their music sucks. And anybody who listens to it is a stinky rat with awful trash taste in music. Thank you, BTS. More like f off BTS. Your music sucks and you have no real talent. 
as opposed to fake talent. Mm -hmm. I hate talented, has no talent, sucks, bad music, tank, flop, flop, Melody Martinez, BTS, Blackpink, Twice, Looney, Itzy, Nicki Minaj, Cardi B, Dixie, Demelio, Charlie Demelio, FKA, Twigs, Lana Del Rey, Ariana Grande, Doja Cat, Billie Eilish. Cheap, lying, no good, rotten, four flushing, low life, snake licking, dirt eating, inbred, overstuffed, ignorant, blood sucking, dog kissing, brainless, hopeless, hopeless heartless, fat, bug eyed, stiff legged, spotty lip. Worm-headed sack of monkey he is. Hallelujah. Holy s***. Where's the Tylenol? Okay, so BTS, it's garbage, okay? Roast me all you want, Stans. Jungkook's hair looks f***ed up. The music sucks. The entire fandom just sucks. If you aren't toxic, then cool. I don't care. Like the music because I'm sticking with metal. I'm sure all BTS fans are following you closely for your approval. Bro, BTS sucks Jung Cook low key got the worst song solos. I got someone better, Jug Cook. He's better and actually has good music. I don't even know what to say to that one. BTS sucks, BTS ugly, BTS <laughs> BTS bad music. BTS no care what you say. Next up is the redhead ginger demon with no soul, Ed Sheeran. Ed Sheeran orders a Happy Meal and chews on the toy and the box. And his music also sucks big <laughs> Are you trying to say he's mentally challenged or a toddler or something? That's just a weird diss. Using a smart speaker when you have a bad music taste must suck. Imagine the pure embarrassment from saying, okay, Google, play Ed Sheeran out loud. Why, are they using their smart speaker while shopping at Walmart? It's definitely not as bad as that groovy 1970s handlebar mustache you got there, pal. Film any pornos lately? Ed Sheeran, his music sucks, but white people eat that up. I guess I'm not white then. I hardly ever listen to Ed Sheeran's music. You guys are so mean to Ed Sheeran. Yeah, his new music sucks, but his first few albums are really where it's at. Aw, oh, what a nice thing to say. Ed Sheeran's music sucks, and he's only famous because he's so hot. Hmm, perception. I don't think Ed Sheeran sucks. I think his music sucks. Ed seems like a chill dude, and I'm sure he would love to hang out with you. Next up is Billie Eilish. Ariana is a queen, but Billie Eilish is the most overrated person over. She kinda ugly, and her music sucks, HTH. I don't think Billie Eilish is ugly at all. What the hell is a person ode? I don't listen to a lot of mainstream pop music, mostly because most of it sucks powdered giraffe balls. So naturally, I had no idea who Billie Eilish is. Hmm, <laughs> who doesn't love powdered giraffe balls? Billie Eilish makes music for that suck green eyeshadow on. I don't even know what that means. I'm not even sure if that's an insult or a compliment. Billie Eilish, only thing you got right in your obsidious speech is you're right. We don't need you to tell us anything. Not only does your music suck, but anyone that would color their hair half green and half black should be committed. I bet this person would love to live in a handmaid's tale. Join us for brunch Tuesday when we'll be executing women for showing their ankles in public. First, Billy, do your hair, it looks like puke. Second, your music sucks. And third, do research because you're so dumb, oh, should slap your mother. Irony. Next up is Beyonce. Beyonce sucks her music, has no substance to go along with the mediocre vocals. Beyonce sucks her music? Oh, I see. Comma. Beyonce's music sucks, though. Who needs 37 songwriters to come up with vapid bull Hey, I can't really say anything about that. They do have a lot of songwriters on one song these days. This is in response about Lana Del Rey. The reason why I don't listen to her music, her lyrics, her music do not make sense at all. She sucks. I'd rather put up a song of Beyonce than one of hers. Damn, that's worse than just saying Beyonce sucks. I hate Beyonce. Her music sucks and she's overrated and part of the Illuminati. Come on guys, there's no such thing as the Illuminati and lizard people. Virus that must not be named sucks and so does your music. Hmm, virus that must not be named or Beyonce's music. Hmm. All fans of Beyonce, don't be a fan of her or she'll possess you as a demon. Don't listen to her music, she sucks ass. Billy Joel sucks. I will find you, Kim. So, there you go. Where else can you get that bigotry, sexism, conspiracy theories, and just pure unadulterated hate? So, like the video, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you later. No redhead ginger demons were harmed during the filming of this video.